whenever an end user logs into Windows with Windows Hello for Business, then they're automatically granted what's called a cloud TGT and a partial TGT. And these TGTs are called ticket granting tickets. And so like the end user flow would be, I open my laptop, I sign in, I get these tickets. That doesn't mean you, you get, get access them to from resources. Entra, right? Those yes. tickets are from Entra. Yep. Yes. Very similar to a PRT. If anyone is familiar with the devices world, kind of similar when you like first log in, you get a devices like PRT, primary refresh token. Very similarly, you get this cloud TGT, partial TGT from Entra. And that is also very convenient because that happens by default. The tenant admin does not need to configure anything for that to mm. happen. It nice. just happens, which allows for a very productive flow for end users so that they don't have to do something clunky to get this TGT. It's just automatically there. So that's lovely. And then, so you have this TGT, but like, how do you actually get access to the resource that you want to get access to? So what happens there is that the user goes to whatever app they want to look at and the app will request for this TGT. Um, and so as the user is trying to access, like something essentially in the process we need to give them what's called a tgs which is a ticket granting service and you exchange your tgt to get a tgs and then this tgs can be given to the application and then the application will give them access yep yes so we have a entra has a relationship with on-prem ad so we actually create what's called this trust relationship between on-premises AD into what's called kerberos.microsoftonline.com, which is the Kerberos realm. And so by creating this trust relationship, we have like this application that is on-prem can trust this ticket that's coming from Entra.